from comedy horror to comic book adaptations. British filmmaker Edgar Wright is known for putting a spin on every genre he touches. And being a child of the 70s, he's now taking on the classic heist movie, something his cast are very excited about. Scott Pilgrim? Hi, I was thinking about asking you out, but then I realized how stupid that would be. That's okay, you need to sign for this, all right? With the visual language he created in Scott Pilgrim vs. the World, Edgar Wright deconstructed the comic book adaptation. Plays music to drown it out, and that's what makes him... He treats the crime film in a similar innovative manner in his throwback to old anti-hero driver films. Baby Driver is an action heist film driven by music. The main character in Baby Driver, Baby, has tinnitus, the ringing in his ears, really bad. So he has to listen to music all the time to drown that out. And he also happens to be a getaway driver. And the music he listens to is the soundtrack of the movie. Just like in his previous films, Edgar Wright has managed to bend conventions once again. He had an accident when he was a kid. A heist musical. It's almost like a new genre. It's never been done before. It is so fresh and so dope. It's good for everyone. Like, young people will like it, old people will like it. This is Mike Myers! It should be the Halloween man! Co-star Jamie Foxx took particular pleasure from his role, which allowed him to reflect on racial politics in film. I love... Uh, an all-white cast where I'm, the only <laughs> black, where I'm the only black person, so I stand out. They could have picked... We well, couldn't pick several of us. There's only eight of us. It's Terrence, and then there's Will, and then there's Morgan Freeman, and then there's Denzel, but, you know, they don't know. They don't. Edgar Wright, a self-confessed music connoisseur, handpicked each track featured in the film. Danger Mouse, Blur, Queen and Beck are among the artists on the eagerly anticipated soundtrack. I'm a driver. 